My name is Thomas Vale. Or at least it was. I'm a photographer. I had it all. A wife, Allison, friends, a career. And in one moment, it was all taken away. All because of a single photograph. I have it. They want it. And they will do anything to get the negative. Now that all the food's here, you should know you really could have bought me off with just the cheesecake. You're that easy? Yeah. Isn't that why you married me? Correct me if I'm wrong, but I was saved like, you know, any... Well, that's not true. <laughs> Sorry, I'm she just remembering. I wasn't saved at all. I wasn't, saved. Fact. I wasn't saved being really evil and really awful. Everything okay, ma'am? Officer, please, this man hid in the backseat of my car. I've never seen him before in my life. He's insane. Allison, what are you saying? Stay away from me. Do you understand what I'm saying? Don't talk to me. Don't come to my house. But you just... What did you expect me to say? You're sick. You need help. But even when you're doing that bad girl at the very last yeah. episode yeah. on some level, you're probably thinking, well, I've got to... I've got to kind of set myself up for maybe being found out in a f subsequent episode to be good. Right. So how do I play this, this bad girl pretending to be good who we discover is bad, but maybe she really is good. Exactly. So, it's well, kind why of, am I it's, doing as an actor, things? it's kind of that thing that happens, I think, sometimes too. Not that this show, this show was not a soap opera. It was a very interesting psycho thriller. But in soap operas, you know, actors are left because they're not, they don't know. The, you know, so they have, they kind of do those. <laughs> Did I leave? Did I leave the oven on? Kind of, you know, because you don't, you can't really <laughs> tip. You don't know what's going on. And on this show, anything was possible. All of that could have been a dream. Anything that yeah. happened could yeah. have suddenly yeah. been a dream. Yeah. So you could never play anything absolutely. Well, you, you had to make strong choices, but there had to be a way out in some way. Well, that's the trick. You have to make these strong choices, and you don't know where they're going to lead. Where you. they're going to lead. Right. I mean, I, we could have ended up being each other. Exactly. You know, I could have woken up one morning and I could have been in your head oh my and dressed, God. you know, I mean. As it, as it went on, because we had as much information as anybody else, I mean, I, I don't know if you or were ever less. given, or less. No, no, of course not. <laughs> no, you weren't given like a Bible of the show or what was supposed to happen. Um, I had to believe, I think even if you play bad characters, you need to believe that, I, I, I suspect, that even very evil people think somehow rationalize that they're doing the right thing. There is no them. There is no enemy. It's just you and me. I had to play that she was in love with him and was put in a bad, very bad situation, threatened. Um, that's just sort of how I got through the day with it. But, you know, I, I, we, we weren't given the information of what really was going on, so uh, that's more just sort of an actor's choice. I guess the honeymoon is over. I had a lot of fun with him, and, um, and so I was very excited to come back. In fact, I think I was bugging Larry and saying, so, you know, I'm, I'm coming back, right? Allison's the one who's, I'm, I'm going to come back, because I'm yeah, kind of at the middle we of it. because we were desperate for some kind of continuity, <laughs> and, like, we were the only... The, the yeah, I think I, really I came knew, back like right? five or six times, and, yeah, that, yeah. and it was him, man. The whole <laughs> thing was him. Um, so it was sort of the thread, you know, that, that went along. You're so cold. Thank you. I just screw him over royally. Huge, yeah. 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 Show about paranoia, really. <laughs> and alienation and disappointment yeah. and... Yeah, and expecta dashed expectations and yeah, yeah, really great stuff. <laughs> like an evening, yeah. really made you want to nod off and go to sleep after they exactly. filled your psyche Let's with. Let's watch this show and realize that our lives are better than that poor guy. <laughs> that poor sap who doesn't know what's going on. Are you pretending to be somebody else? Sit down. Bruce was the center of the show, and so everything kind of and I, I, I really. I mean, I, I would say this even if he weren't sitting right here. <laughs> I, I love him. He's just a great guy. And we became friends then and, uh, uh, and still are after still 10 is, years. Yeah. I have children now, so I never see anyone that I know. Anyone. I, we do not socialize at all. Um, but that said, you know, I... Uh, the kids are part of yours. Yes. Yeah, 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 exactly. Um, and so that's, the, for me, that's what I remember, was that, that we just had a, a really nice rapport and that it was fun working with him. And, and it was also, it was a show I watched every episode. 
I used to I used to call and you know after and we we talk. Yeah. 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 I was very yeah. loyal. I was a loyal viewer. So. And, and that we was... were also were told by the producers that we needed as many people watching as possible. <laughs> <laughs> and we watched it with double the viewership. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, I didn't have it in me. Things happen. People change. This thing again? Kill me Where the hell does it come from? Some kind of a pirate broadcast. I heard a rumor they do it down in Mexico. Hey, leave it. It's good. I thought, um, now I won't be allowed to go to Seattle, but I, I, I really prefer Portland to Seattle and other, uh, it's, I, I thought love it was a Portland. great I city. Love Portland. And I also love Vancouver, actually. I really love Vancouver. And that's kind of home for Yeah, it's home for, for me, guys. sort of. Yeah. 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 And, um, but, uh, but I loved Portland. Portland was really, really cool. There was a lot of good stuff going on. We, we all hung out a couple times up there and yeah, there's some great good restaurants stores, and, good mu yeah. Well, good music, good music scene. Um, but not that we could suck up too much of it, you know? Yeah, not, Like yeah. Saturday night would be the only night, right? Pretty much, yeah. Because you have to get to bed early on Sunday. Or you're working, you know? And all of those darker shows tend to go just until the wee hours on Friday, because you're always doing night stuff. Yeah. And then you have to be up, and this was true of Millennium too. And then you have to, and then you have to be back at work at 5:30 or 6 o'clock in the morning on Monday. So, can I get you anything else? It all I think comes from the top. Um, uh, you know, your executive producer, writer, creator. <laughs> yeah, they set the tone. You know, they uh, set the tone, and and uh, when they're there. Yeah, when they're there, and really, uh, you know, while. While the director can do, um, they can do some harm. Uh, they they can do they can do certain you know creative things, but there's usually a, a style that's been established, and they need to sort of follow that. And the actors and the writers, it's kind of, it's more like theater in a, in a way because the it's more of an actor writer sort of medium. First writer, then actor, um, and you tend to know more about your character than than any director will who's coming in for. An episode, you know, yeah, they're, it's they're very around handy. for a brief. It's yeah, extremely handy. If there's a director yeah. who comes in and wants you to do something, you just and you say no. But my character, in, right. independent of <laughs> Vale's, you know, sort of instinct to do or not to do, you can Bruce's instinct by go, yeah, I don't want to be seen doing that. I don't want to. I don't, I don't do think that. I'm gonna be doing that. And be <laughs> I don't assumed, want to do you know, that. I think maybe I just say the character wouldn't do that. <laughs> exactly. And so, exactly. so you say that to the director, and he goes, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Go, okay. Go, okay. Yeah, I would never. No, no, no. <laughs> Get away with that. In fact, exactly. I don't think that my character would come in for work today, but I never managed, <laughs> never managed to do that. 